What's up VIPs? In this tutorial, we will be explaining and exploring the Scalps Dev Kit HUD so you can start making your own Scalps appliers or your own Scalps uh, style HUDs. Um, and each Scalps Dev Kit, whether you have this one or this one, they're essentially the same. And if you don't know how to unpack these, go back and, and view our video, our last video about how to unpack these if you haven't done that already. But in each dev kit, um, you have a plethora of things that will help you get to creating. You have your demo head. Let's go ahead and copy this, copy this to inventory. So in each scout kit, dev kit, you have your demo head, your developer license, your um, instructions your written instructions and <clears throat> you also have uh, the male and female the hom and femme style hoods now for each let, let's uh you also have demos just in case you don't have um, the actual unit I would advise everybody to just go buy the unit, especially if you're a developer for this. Just go ahead to the main store and get the real unit um, so that you can try your stuff real time. But just in case, you know, some people might not have the cash to buy the real unit. You could also uh, you can also just add the demo unit depending on which head you have. And, you know, of course, you'll have demo apply, but you'll still be able to like see uh, what your hair base looks like now this tutorial is for people who already have who are already familiar with um, working with 3d assets so um, this is not a tutorial about how to make this or, or how to make the 3d texture we'll be doing more of those types of tutorials later on this is for developers who already are familiar uh, with with how to work with a 3d you know texture um, this is this is the scalps developer kit go ahead and grab one of those from the, uh, the main store if you haven't already and download the 3d file for it uh, but this tutorial is more for people who already have their their hair base done they got the they exported the 2d version um, and they've already made they've already made uh, thumbnails and they're ready they're just ready to plug all of this stuff into the hood um, and I know a lot of my more advanced users already have done all of this so if you've reached this point where you have got your textures ready you got your thumbnails ready this tutorial is for you um, so how did how the dev kit works is it comes with all of these things and it also we also included a, a demo uh, a scalps demo head which is great for if you just want to drag and drop the texture or if you want to see like if you're working on your texture in Photoshop and you know you're making little micro changes to whatever the texture is and you just want to you know preview it you can go here click uh, select face and um, change it's modifiable so you can like go on local and like add your texture to like you know um, see what it looks like in real time um, and that and also when you add a local hair base it'll as long as you save in the program like if I make any modification and uh, save in a program it'll update uh, here real time so that way you don't you're not wasting money on uploads trying to see you know what your product looks like but this is also great for if you just want to drag and drop without and, and see what your texture looks like without having to uh, <clears throat> use the kit but this tutorial is for the kit itself so in the kit you have a hom and fem uh hud this is the this is the the fem hud so we're also gonna res hom hud as well <clears throat> and with these with these uh developer kits you need to have your scouts developer license now mines well I have to find mine that says it should say no copy and no mod so scouts developer. so this is uh, my developer license that I will be using it should look just like this it should say no copy no modify um, and in order to make the actual 
dev kit what you're gonna do is like we're gonna let's start with the, the home because uh, my this avatar is a male has the male fit on so let's start with the home and what you're gonna do is you're just gonna drag your developer license boom right into um, the hood and when you do that uh, let's see. when you do that in local chat you'll see where it says developer license found right um, um, but also make sure that you have already uploaded your textures too so let me go ahead um, go ahead and upload the textures too that we want to use to make this hopefully I'm not crashing fuck I might be crashing okay I didn't crash alright so <laughs> um, what, you, what I'm gonna do is upload all the textures that I want to use to create this kit with so boom so the way scalps is set up right is that you're essentially going to be making two developer uh kits but they're going to all have the same textures um because scalps is optimized for a unisex kind of feel you just you know need a different hood depending on what head you have and um for everybody who don't have who don't have these heads um that current scouts 1.2 is currently made for we are working on updates for this but those will be announced uh, as we get them anyway so I'm gonna upload the textures that you want to use right and then uh, what you're gonna do is once you have your developer license in there you're gonna go to like uh, one of these thumbnails to select a base texture right and um, the UUID is the hair base right so this is the actual hair base so this is the 100 uh this is the 100 style that i did and what i want to do is just copy that uuid and plug it copy paste boom now for your user or for the buyers or whomever you're making this for or even for yourself you want to know exactly what you're applying or what they're applying so you need to make sure that you put like the respective uh, representation for that hair. So this one, this is my 100 thumbnail. So what I'm gonna do is copy the UUI ID for that. Click it, go to thumbnail, paste, boom. So now that that's in there, um, and I'm gonna do this for all of, all of my, um, hair bases so I'm probably gonna pause this video uh, so that I could go ahead and do them for all four and come back uh, when that's done so now that we got everything plugged into the developer kit uh, what we're gonna do is get either uh, we're gonna put the demo on or well, one I'm gonna make I'm gonna take the developer kit out so what I'm gonna do is drag my developer license back into my inventory I guess because it's no copy and then press reset scripts so everything could be back you know, right and then in order to test this what we're gonna do is since we already have the, the um, demo head on um, I, there is a glitch with these so you have to click whatever head you have first before trying to apply anything so um, I'm just gonna click you know whatever head I think um, he's wearing four right now so or, or no Luca so click that first and then click the actual um, the actual texture to see if it worked and if we scroll up here you will see yep he's on there and uh, you can actually pick this up and uh, wear it if it's easier for you to try stuff but like 
you know, just toggle between all of them and make sure all of your textures work. If you only have one texture, that's fine too. But this specific HUD could take up to six textures. If you got to make more than one HUD, do it. Um, if you want to give your customers more options, that's what's up. Uh, but yeah, that's essentially how you do that. And um, now this, this particular HUD is ready for sale. All you're going to do is... Um, make sure that you change these permissions so before you sell it you want to make sure that this is no mod no trans right um and then you know before you you make sure you set that up and then you take it into your inventory um and from there it's ready to sell now uh make sure you do the exact same thing for your fem heads as well that's really essentially more money for you because it's like it's, it's really the same uv for a male and female so whatever um hair that you or scalp that you've made for a female or male uh please make sure that you make uh, the same thing or you make the same hood for both male and female hood so your customers if they're wearing a, a female head they can come in and, and you know do the same thing so just copy the same steps that we did here into this hood um if you want you can you can further protect your your images or your your hair bases by you know throwing a watermark over your your texture so that um you can make demo hood so if i was going to make a demo hood i would just essentially copy these and um now you don't have to redo the thumbnail portion of the dev kit you, you can just go in and click and um update the texture to a watermarked version of your hair and uh, that's how you make the demos for these um if y'all need help with that, or if y'all you, you, want me to explain that part in, in more depth, uh, let me know. But I'm pretty sure if you're a creator and you already know how to make demos. But uh, yeah, that's how you use this developer kit. Um, please, please, please make sure you guys set the permissions on your dev kits because you don't want people out here passing your hard work around for free. <laughs> you know, so make sure you set your um, your scalps huds to uh copy no transfer no modify um so that the next person who you give your scalp uh textures away to or you sell them to uh they just they don't have that type of access so yeah that's it for this tutorial um all of these directions that we just went over can also be found in the note card that says read this our our karate chop you in the throat so uh yeah you know you i forgot to go over the naming mechanisms but you can really name this whatever you want um this is my float hair base so i'm probably gonna just name this unorthodox you know unorthodox scalps um float hair base and I have an example of, you know, the name of how you could do this. Um, but yeah, a flow hair base. Um, yeah, and uh, take that in. Yeah, y'all get it. <laughs> this tutorial is getting a little bit lengthy, so I'm going to end it here. But if, as always, if you guys need help, um, either you can hit the our CSRs up in our group in world or you can hit up our discord make sure you join our discord or you can hit tony O'Harmison in world and um we'd be happy to to get you some help with this uh, look forward to seeing y'all creations with the scouts developer kit and uh yeah excited to see how that go peace so don't you know